Hello friends, uh, today we will be discussing how to remove nuclear fragments uh, during phaco emulsification cataract surgery. Uh, last time we had discussed how to do stop and chop and how to divide and conquer the nucleus uh, during phaco emulsification cataract surgery. So uh, in the last video as uh, you are seeing right now, uh, this is how we are doing stop and chop and to, in this video we will discuss how to remove nuclear fragments after making all the nuclear pieces. So what is important is to, with the help of vacuum grab on the nuclear fragments and bring them to the central safe zone and emulsify. Always emulsify in the central 5 mm of safe zone. Do not emulsify the nuclear fragments in the periphery as that can lead to complications. Uh, what I usually do is keep the bevel tip sideways. You can also keep the bevel tip downwards and emulsify the nuclear fragments. Uh, you can either emulsify the nuclear fragments in the bag or in the iris plane. I usually use the iris plane for emulsifying the nuclear fragments. Um, the FACO tip should be always fixed in the center. Don't move the tip. Use your left hand, the Sinski. And the, all the maneuver should be done with the left hand. Uh, in short, the left hand acts as a feeder. You can bring all the nuclear pieces to the FACO tip with the help of Sinski and emulsify. Uh, what uh, usually what a beginner should do is they should always keep one nuclear fragment in the bag which acts as a barrier between the phaco tip and the posterior capsule in order to uh, avoid complications. Uh, what I do in the last piece I use ultrasound 4 uh, in which, uh, which causes less AC fluctuation and less complications to occur. Uh, I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.